I'm Gabrielle Pantera. I'm here with Tommy Palm of King.com. What was attractive to King about your company that they acquired you? Well, uh, King saw the trend that, that mobile is, is really strong right now. And mm -hmm. a lot of the uh, time spent on the PC is now moving over to smartphones and tablets. Right. So they realized the potential. This is going to be the market within the next few years. And um, Fabrication Games is a, a company, we have a lot of uh, industry veterans. I've personally worked over 13 years with mobile games. Okay. So um, I've been through all the different transitions and that, that's my area of expertise. So I think that uh, they mostly were after the, the very experienced team that knows a lot about this market. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, to make sure that they were going to be as successful on mobile as they are on, on social. So they also acquired the games that you, you had as well, correct? Uh, well, some of the games that, uh, that oh, okay. we had so, so fell into their category that they were interest that that fitted them. But but uh, they're mostly after the team and and our um, game engine. Oh, okay, okay. So what's the difference between a Facebook game and a game for mobile aside from the speed? Yeah, well, it's a very interesting question. There is actually a lot of similarities. And one of the reasons that, that we were attracted uh, to do the deal with King was that we felt in order to be really successful on mobile, you have to have uh, the audience and the, the, the marketing power, but also the tools to be able to measure certain uh, key factors. One of them is the, the retention, the stickiness that the game has. Okay. Is people coming back to play, play it the second day and, and you know, after a week? Because there is extremely amount of competition on mobile games. Are the games individual, or um, you can play against other people? Uh, no, Pretty these sure. are social games. You don't play against other people, but you do play with your friends. So okay, so so they're like you can set up a team of you playing against maybe another group of friends, or just against the game itself. Uh, against the game itself. Against so, the game itself. Yeah. Okay. So okay. you can. Uh, there are a lot of these social hooks where you can um, send additional coins, etc., to your friends, and they can help you out on that level. So they can go to king.com, find out more, and to, and or to Facebook after they get to go to king.com to get the link. Yeah, search uh, at Facebook for, for Bubble Witch Saga, for instance. That, that's Bubble, the, Bubble Witch Saga? Yeah. Bubble Witch Saga, okay. So talk a little bit more about the game engine. All right. Uh, well, it's something that we have developed uh, throughout the course of, of the games that we have mm -hmm. made. And one of the, the core focuses there is to make sure that we can develop one source code and it will be able to, to run on the many different platforms. You have okay. Android right now, which is the biggest platform. Mm -hmm. doesn't monetize the best currently, okay. but, it, but it's very big in terms of player. Okay. And then we have iOS, of course, which is, is the, the big one. Uh, and then there are a lot of other um, out there as well, but these are the two core core focus ones. So our game engine is built from the start to, to be cross-platform. So, so uh, it's developed in C++, and then it's, uh, it runs on, on Objective-C, which is used uh, mm -hmm. and, uh, in, uh, in the iOS environment and also for Android. And so it works with the, um, it's the Windows, because Windows has their own platform now too that they're really trying to push. Yes, well, Windows has their own platform, but uh, they're also very um, different from the other ones because they don't allow uh, OpenGL ES, which is the standard oh. graphics library for, for the phones. So they have their own version of DirectX, okay. so you need to redo that. and. Currently, for Windows 7, they're not allowing C++, native C++ either. Oh, that's going to hurt them. Yes, uh, it has had a tremendous impact mm -hmm. on the popularity of their their platform because a lot of game developers like us uh, don't take our games to, to that platform due to we have to rewrite the code from scratch. Right, it, it's not um, conducive to um, use everywhere. Exactly. Okay.